welcome back to QuickBits. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install the Google add-ons in the Google Docs. So this is the Google Docs page. Uh, we go into the extension. Uh, we go to add-ons, get add-on. There you go. Here we we see the filter is by Docs, right? For ad applications, you can uh, pick some other stuff. And then in here, it the default locations basically include both uh, free and the paid ones. Uh, so for our use case, let's just say free, right? And then we we will look for this like uh, popular add-on called the uh, Docs to Markdown. So select one of these. Uh, if you're not familiar with what the Markdown is, don't worry about it. Uh, I'm just going to show you the special formatting that's used in the coding. Okay. Um, here we go, we click this, then we click install. Now we have to sign in to our Google account. Here we go, we gotta continue again. Yep, gotta allow more stuff. Okay. Now it's loading. Hopefully. Okay, here you go. It's done. It tells us how to use it, right? You go to the extensions. Okay. Um, okay, cool. So now it's installed. And now we can test it, right? So we have this text here where we have uh, uh, text in bold. And then we have regular text. Basically, what the markdown is, is the special formatting where you can um, format it by using different syntax, right? And it's used primarily in documentation in uh, some open source projects. Um, but not necessarily open source, but like coding projects. So let's say we want to convert this text, right? So what we do is we select it, we say extension, add-on, uh, well actually we go extension to our markdown add-on, and we say convert docs to markdown. Then we'll see the window popped up here. We can say, okay, what do we want to do? Uh, I guess in this case, we just say manually download images. Uh, and then we want to convert this text, right? There you go. I mean, I tried it this before. It already shows right away. Uh, but basically, yeah. This is a markdown, markdown syntax for you, right? Um, like, this is actually means, like, the, the bold. Um, but, yeah, for the big complicated cases, this is very useful. Uh, and there are some other add-ons that might be useful for your specific use case. Uh, I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe. Uh, thank you very much.